everyone, it's Carla. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time tuning in, hello, my name is Carla. I want to tell you, first of all, I do not edit or everything just stays in here. I like to film it and then get it up as soon as possible so I can get it up for you. So my two fur babies, Lucky and Roxy, are up here. So hopefully uh, they do not interrupt too much. So let's get started. Just wanted to film a little quick haul. I went to Walgreens and kind of went crazy. But I want to show you some of the cool stuff that I got. Um, I realized, I didn't know it, but that Walgreens is carrying some elf products now. So I got a few new products to try. So we're just going to jump in. So this will be my my first time looking at them swatching them too so we'll do it together so kind of boring the first thing I got was this studio 35 beauty it's really cool you just have to pump it to get the uh, phenol polish remover out so I got that wanted to try that then I've been looking for Essie's boom boom room it's a limited edition color very beautiful pink color cannot find it but I did see this bottle service um, it's not really doing it justice. It kind of looks orangey pink here. It's not. It is the most beautiful hot pink color I think I've ever seen. But I've kind of got some natural light going, some artificial light going, so you can't really see it. So I'll have to paint it and um, take a picture and put it on Instagram. So please follow me. It's Carla Atkins, A D as in dog, K I N S, on Instagram and Facebook. I uh, don't really get on Twitter. So um, I will be trying to paint my nails this color in a little while and I will post a picture. Then the next thing that I got before we jump into the elf is this little Yes to Blueberries. I actually saw this on um, Mallory1817, I think her channel. I think it was hers. It might not have been hers. I'm sorry. I get all my names mixed up. But it says it's the Age Refresh Eye Firming Treatment. So I am getting older and I am having wrinkles. Yeah, so, and my face is really not that oily. I do get oily, but I think it's the light. So, I'm going to try this out, and I will let you know what I think of that. Then I got two little Sally Hansen's Emery Wards, because I need to file these nubs up. Then I just got, I thought I got, I did get three brushes. I got three e.l.f. brushes. Um, the white ones are a dollar, and I have all these high-end brushes, and it's like I'm scared to use them. I need to use them, learn how to use them. And then I got this one. I think this one's like a $3 one. So, just got the staples, the blending eye brush, the eyeshadow brush, and this is supposed to be an eyeshadow C brush, whatever it's supposed to be. Some kind of special brush, I guess. <laughs> so, that's some of the e.l.f. products I got. Then I got this e.l.f. lip stain. And it is in pink petal. So I guess you just probably should have read the directions too before. Maybe just I'm not sure really what you do. Maybe you don't push or do anything to it. Maybe it's just like that. Not too sure about that. Probably can't really even see it. But not too sure about that. I might have to read the directions. But anyway, this is probably a... But I think it was like a dollar or two, so I thought I'd try it. And then I've been loving these Jumbo Lip Gloss Sticks. This is actually not as brown as it looks. It's called Sangria Starters. And it's really, really light. So I'm not sure about that either. That's that right there. Not too sure about that either. But something I have been loving that I did not get at Walmart, excuse me, Walgreens, I don't even know where I went, is the Tarte Enchanted Lip Surgeon's Natural Lip Tint. And it's called, it's an enchanting. I have it on right now. It is such, such a beautiful color and consistency. Um, my bestie was wearing this. Shout out to you, Catherine. And I had to get me one, and I did get her one, too. I haven't gave it to her yet, so if she's watching this, then I guess she already knows. But um, that's it right there. It's such a beautiful reddish pink. Just beautiful, and it feels amazing on the lips, and it does stain after the gloss. Um, of course, wears off. It's still You still have a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful... Sorry about that. I'm trying to get a paper towel to wipe this off before it does really stain my hand. A beautiful color. Back to the Walgreens haul. I picked up this Rimmel Lasting Finish Lipstick in Amethyst Shimmer. 
Of course, it's a pinky mauve. One of my favorite colors, of course, pinky mauve. And that is gorgeous. This lighting is not doing it justice. Um, it's a pinky, brighter, purpley mauve. And I know that I swatched this in the store. And now I've lost my... Sorry, I just got real close to the camera. This does stain. So this is going to be awesome to wear. Stain your lips. And then when it wears off, just put some gloss over it. Then... I'm not sure if this is the exact same one that I heard uh, Mel MPH talking about. Um, the Milani Liquid Eye. She was talking about a purple one. This one's called Purple Murado. And it's an absolutely gorgeous purple. But then, once I swatched it, it's purple. But then it has black. It's... I know you're not going to be able to see it. But it's like an iridescent purpley black. So I am going to try that. I'm not sure too sure about it right now but it is just absolutely gorgeous it looks flat black and then when you turn it and swivel it it has like an iridescent purple so it is very beautiful so I do look forward to trying that and it looks like it's going to definitely stay on then another elf product that I saw at Mail MPA talk about that was a Milani product sorry I'm jumping around his is beautiful gorgeous gorgeous light pink blush. She said it's a dupe for one of the Elamascus. I forget the color. And of course, this is definitely not going to do it justice. It is a very pale, light pink, shimmery color, but definitely buildable color. Not too shimmery. Not any sparkle fallout. Just a, a real pretty baby, baby doll pink. And it, it's just as blushing. It doesn't really have a color, but it's absolutely... Woohoo, there's me. He gorgeous. Sorry, I'm just kind of like, Ooh. Another e.l.f. product, I think this is the last e.l.f. product, is this lip exfoliator. Oh, it's cool looking. It looks like one of those bars of soaps that's an exfoliator. So, that's what that looks like. I'm going to try it and let you know, because sometimes, you know, when you get the crusties around your lips, it is not attractive, especially when you put on your lip liner and... You girls know what I'm talking about. I have a mess over here on my counter. I'm so sorry. And I'm also going to try this Milani Brow Tint pen. Not too sure about this. I will try and let you know. It says it's a felt tip brow color. I have been using a Milani brow pencil, but it's not a felt tip. Because my eyebrows grow to about, I guess, right there. And then the rest... Yeah, you know, I have to color in, so I don't know. But anyway, um, I'm practicing, learning, hopefully getting a little bit better at it. Then, I got, of course, all of you have seen this because I've seen it all over YouTube before. It's the Contouring Blush and Bronzing Powder by e.l.f. And it's the one that looks a heck of a lot like the NARS Orgasm and Laguna. And that's what I'm wearing on my face today. I have the Laguna on, the NARS Laguna um, highlighter, and then I have the Balm Down Boy. It's a really pretty pink. That's what I have on my cheeks right now. Then, check out these gorgeous L'Oreal Color Riche eyeshadows. This one is in Sultry sultry seductress this one is rose for romance I'm not sure how good you can see this but i actually watched a tutorial with the this one the sultry seductress and it this purple is gorgeous I'm not sure if you can tell those colors but it aren't those beautiful i cannot wait to wear them and show y'all how those are Let's see if I can open this one. The Rose for Romance. Just gorgeous. Just beautiful. You have three shimmers and then looks kind of like a flat matte, but it does have a little shimmer. I think that's going to be absolutely gorgeous. That's by L'Oreal. And then last but not least, I have probably forgotten something because like I said, this is a mess. I wanted to try the Revlon Photo Ready 3D Volume. Oh man, I got the waterproof. Oh well. Um, it looks like this. I heard Miss Lola Lynn talking about this being a dupe for the benefits They're Real. 
And I just love, look at that tip right there. And she was like, it's good for getting in and, and getting them up. So um, that's what that looks like. Real excited to use this and let y'all know what I think about it. Um, today I'm wearing the, um, the new CoverGirl Flamed Out. And of course, over it I have the L'Oreal Telescopic. And... Um, I really like it. I do have a picture post on my Instagram of an eye before mascara and after mascara, and you can see. I do not actually, I don't know, I don't, you know what, I think I do on a sample of the benefits, they're real. So I need to try it, and then try this. That, that brush is just, yeah, I know I keep showing it. It's just amazing me. Um, and then I'm going to try the pho the Revlon Photo Ready 3D Volume, and I'll let you know. Um, if Miss Lola Lynn thinks it's a dupe, then by golly it's a dupe so if you don't have if you had not checked her out you can um if you subscribe to me which please do it will be um sorry this is shaking because the animals are getting wild um she i am subscribed blah, blah 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 i am subscribed to her and excuse me um if you look at my history or what i like you'll see hers and male mp M Mel M P H I think anyway Melissa she is amazing too some of my favorites and Mallory eighteen seventeen I think her name is she's amazing too Shades by Cassie or Casey Cassie I think it is she's amazing too so just kind of giving some shout outs to some um, girly gurus on here that I've been watching and that I look up to and admire and hopefully one day um, maybe can have the popularity they do but for now thank you guys for watching i hope you liked everything i showed you i like to share the things that i get um just to say hey look what's out there you know um so i hope you all have a wonderful wonderful day and a terrific tuesday and i'm hoping to get this uploaded today and i do have a little um review slash how to use the white lightning um whitening system so, I'm going to try to upload that too today. So, until we see each other again, mwah, love to all of you. Please love each other. Please subscribe. Tell your friends about me. Check me out on Instagram and Facebook at Carla Atkins. And I'll see you later. Bye.